All right, hey everybody, I'm Lance Allen here to bring you another fun fingerstyle guitar minutes and uh, what, 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 you know, fingerstyle guitar lesson in five minutes. I love making mistakes on these videos because it makes you laugh and have fun. Today, I want to teach you how to do like a thumb and double stop and then a percussive thing. A lot of people like hear this percussive thing in lots of music. Uh, John Mayer does it. Uh, Man, there's so many great musicians that do it. Even Ed Sheeran, uh, who's who's popular right now. So let's get started with the the percussive thing. Okay, so uh, a happy little percussive, as Bob Ross says. We're gonna have have a happy little drum beat here. So let's start with the G chord. Okay, uh, whichever G chord you want to do is perfectly fine. I'm gonna use my standard traditional G like this. Okay, and basically my thumb's gonna hit the root note of G, which is string six right and then these two fingers pluck string three and two together you can pluck any of those parts of the chord as long as you're making the chord in the left hand you're gonna be fine but I'm gonna pick string three and two for now so you do your thumb and then the double and then we're gonna do the smack okay now let me explain the smack this is gonna take a little bit of effort and aim and precision on your part so let me turn a little bit sideways so you can see what's going on okay so my fingers just did this string two and three and when you come up you're in an upward position like this and my fingers are still kind of glued together and my thumb is going to come down and sort of smack sideways on string six and what that does is it's hitting the string against the frets okay and you just sit there and practice that just get a little rhythm two three four now something else that's important part two is this when you do the smack you want your two fingers to land on strings three and two because that's what we're going to pluck next that kind of thing okay so one and two and it's a strong upbeat so if that makes sense you'll probably be right on par to getting this percussive style down okay so here's what it sounds like one and snap and two and snap You can use that along with any of your chords, like C for example. If I did C though, you want to make sure your thumb starts on string 5. 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and 1 and get jiggy with it. 3 and 4 and 1 and 2 and 3 to the G chord. Uh, yeah, I like that. Let's go to E minor. D, do string four and one and two. One and two and three and four and G. Now, you can use those two fingers for any part of the chord as long as you're making it in the left hand. If I didn't make the, like say if I did a C chord but didn't have that finger down, it might not sound, I mean it kind of sounds good, but you know, if you put it on the second fret or something weird, it's gonna not sound good at all. So, um, okay. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that lesson. My name is Lance Allen, and thank you for joining me in my 5-Minute Finger Style Guitar Class. Make sure you subscribe to the playlist or to Guitar Lancer channel. And if you're interested in listening to my Finger Style Guitar music, head on over to Spotify, right there, you know, pretty little picture, link in the edit box or in the information box, and uh, you'll enjoy it. I just uh, I've released a lot of great music there. and. Uh, Make sure you also check out the playlist of this stuff. And uh, I said that already. Okay. Uh, and uh, hey, I like coffee. If you ever want to buy me a cup of coffee for these lessons, hey, <laughs> there's a link down there. So you can PayPal me uh, five bucks or whatever. I don't care. I like doing these lessons and uh, I'm enjoying teaching people all over the world. So make sure you leave a comment. I'm pretty good about responding. And uh, we'll catch you on the next lesson. Thanks for watching.